Hi guys, welcome or welcome back if you're new here. My name is Sarah and on this channel we do all things beauty. Today I'm going to be doing a try on and wear test on this one size primer and setting spray. So I just got the primer during the Sephora sale. I'm so excited to test this out for myself and you guys. Just like with the Milk Makeup Primer and Setting Spray, I'm a sweaty girl and I'm expecting this summer to be a hot one as my first one in LA heat. The sun just hits different here and I'm starting to feel it already. So today we're gonna be using the Secure the Sweat Dry Till Dawn Primer. This is a mattifying primer and it does say it's best to use if you put a dime size, rub it through your hands to warm it up and then put it on the face and sneak peek, it's looking really good. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. makeup it is one fluid ounce and it's secure the sweat primer facts okay are you guys ready wet proof waterproof shine proof 12 hour oil resistance shine control mattifying primer wow so I am gonna be using some glowy products today but but I want to use this to see how it'll hold up because like I said it's super hot I'm gonna go out today I'm gonna go for a walk so we're gonna be putting it to the test I only want to put this in my t-zone oh my god it is thick whoa this is so thick <gasps> okay so this is not a blur primer like this isn't a pore primer this is a mattifying primer so I'm just putting it in the center of my face which is where I tend to get shiny I don't I don't know if I put too much I think I read somewhere that you have to like really rub it in okay instructions squeeze a dime size drop onto fingertips warm it up and press it into the skin before makeup shoot i didn't really warm it up in my hand first but i'm warming it up on my face i'm just gonna test what this feels like if i were to oh it does it does kind of lose its thickness if you warm it up and it says wait one minute so we're gonna actually give it that one minute to dry down i do see it working though i see it working Feels pretty dry. It definitely mattified those areas, so I'm happy with it. Now we're gonna set the face, and I wanna see how this On Till Dawn setting spray does with the primer. So we're gonna kinda, just like we did with Milk, we're gonna use the one size primer and spray. This is a mattifying waterproof setting spray. I have the mini one. Last time I used this, I didn't really like it, but let's just give them a try together. So thin that it's like hard to tell if it's going on or not. I think that's what's kind of confusing about it. Like it's not a spritz, so I don't know. It feels like that's working though. I feel like I feel like that's gonna do good. I'm I'm very excited for this duo. Milk makeup did well, so let's see how one size does. I'm gonna finish the makeup. The face is looking pretty good. I'm not seeing any sweat coming through where I put majority of the primer. So I'm really excited to see how this lasts. We'll do at least six hours. What do you guys think? Do you think this is gonna hold up better than a milk makeup? Before we get to the end of the video, let me know in the comments really quick. Alrighty guys, this is the six hour check-in and I, one, I'm ready for bed. Two, so hot. The fan is saying that it's 87 degrees in here and I've been sitting in here. We even went for a night walk, 6,000 plus step. What do you guys think of the results? This is what the makeup looks like. I know my lippy is gone. I actually think that this performed better than the day that I did the Milk Pore Eclipse Primer and Setting Spray. I had a really good feeling about one size. I think Patrick Starr is very into his matte, his blurring, all of that. So I had very high expectations and he definitely met them. I'm actually shocked. Like I'm not shocked, but I am shocked because of how hot it is today. Like 90 degrees guys in LA, six hours later, you guys did that one size beauty.